Here's how to calculate both the sum and the count of the same column in a pivot table in Excel. I have a small pivot table here and as you can see I'm calculating the sum of personal cost per department and I would like to also count how many transactions there have been and to calculate both a sum and a count of a pivot table this is what you need to do. In my case I'm going to drag the personal cost again on the value section just like I did the first time when I've added it in here. And now it just created a duplicated column. But next, I'm going to go on the second column and pick value field settings. And from over here, I'm going to pick the count, which is the second option from here. Hit OK. And look at that. I have now calculated both the sum and the count of a column in a pivot table in Excel. This is how you do it. If the video was useful to you, please give it a thumbs up and check out the channels for more videos just like this one.